Ooh. We know what that is. What's going on, YouTube, man? Hopefully, everybody having a blessed and super awesome day, man. I'm back out here in Duluth. I just left Rick Hendrick Dodge, man. And uh, I want to say that I am truly impressed. I am truly impressed. Hendrick Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram Duluth, man. I am super impressed man and extremely blessed um so yesterday i told you guys that um that the bill for my rotors was going to be roughly about three thousand dollars before i left the guy said that he would do a deal for you know he would take care of half and it would be roughly about 1600 after taxes um, but like I said, we went in there and we talked. I was a little frustrated. And YouTube, I'm going to admit, I had an attitude and I acted like a complete asshole. So, before I finish my story, I want to say this, man. Before you go to these places and act like an asshole, sit down and really, sit down and really talk to somebody. As a man, that's a life experience I learned, man. Like, for real. I'm a pretty big dude and... My used to be surroundings caused me to act out. That's really no excuse because I got to grow from that. And I was really upset, man. Uh, I cursed the man out, all kind of stuff, bro. And um, once I calmed down, he said, man, let's talk. So we went in. So, so we went in the guy's office. We talked, man. He said, man, well, I want to help you. But, you know, you got to calm down. So, of course, um, I calmed down. We got to talking. And he said, man, look, this is a very unique situation. I know you just got the car. I know why you're upset. So, but I want to help you, but you got to calm down and allow me to help you. So I said, okay, how you going to help me? Because 1600 ain't really helping me. He said, well, let me reach out to Chrysler and see what they'll do. If they'll pay half, I'll pay half, and you, you, you good. So, first of all, I want to thank God for that young man. I'm not going to put his name out there or whatever because, for you know what I'm saying, for, 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 for his personal reasons. But, um, like I said, man, I acted a fool, cursed the man out. And today, I called him, and he said, so when you going to come pick up your car? I said, well, I got to go by the bank and get some money. And he said, what for? And I said, to pay for my, my, my stuff. And he said, man, come up here and get your car. All of it's been taken care of. So I want to thank God for that, man, bro. Seriously. Look at that, man. See that? See that, YouTube? You can't see the brakes, but it's brand new brakes on there. And those rotors are brand new. See that YouTube? Brand new rotors. See that? Brand new rotors. Brand spanking new rotors, man. So, um, brand new brakes and rotors. I don't know if you noticed, but I got a little tin on that thing too. I got a little tin on that guy. So. Big shout out, man, to Rick Hendrick Dodge. Big shout out to Chrysler. Uh, thank you guys for caring, for one. Thank you for caring because you didn't have to do that. And this is, I want to say, first of all, I apologize to um, to the gentleman and, of course, a couple of the other service reps who heard me get a little bit irate. And I want to apologize again to the young man and like i said we shook hands man and uh and i uh, i definitely appreciate him for doing everything that he did because he didn't have to go the extra mile and call chrysler but after we sat down we talked i calmed down he reached out to chrysler man and uh, and uh i walked out man 
I didn't have to pay for that. Look at that. I know how much this costs. I know these are brand new. No scratches, no scrapes, no nothing on them. I know 1,000% these are brand new. See that, YouTube? See that? Brand spanking new. Brand spanking new. And I can tell the brakes are new. Look at the clip. See that? See those brakes? I I can tell. I can't get the camera off here, man. But I can tell those brakes are new, too. Yep. 1,000... 1,000%, man. So, I got a chance to talk to a couple of the service people when I went in today. They gave me a rental. I didn't pay for the, uh, not the rental, but the, the, the courtesy car to get home. And I want to say, man, that days like today, not just owning a Hellcat, but days like today, make me proud of my brand i ain't gonna lie to you days like today make me proud of my brand man and i just want to say man i greatly appreciate uh hendrick dodge and duluth for helping me out i want to say that uh i think it's uh, rick hendrick or hendrick dodge because it's all the same company but one but some's rick hendrick and some's hendrick dodge so hendrick dodge and duluth I want to say, man, big shout out to y'all, man. I greatly appreciate that. And that's coming from Lee Law, a.k.a. Gargo Selmo Selm. So, like I say, man, uh, the tent's 35%. Um, the back window's also tinted. But, of course, you have to be able to see legally. You have to be able to see through the front. So, everything's legal. Everything's legal. The tent looks absolutely amazing. I actually, they actually put door guards on as well. So I have door guards on. You may or may not be able to see them because they put them the same color. It's going to be kind of hard to see the door guards. I can see them, but you may not be able to see them. That's, see what a seam is right there? They put So they put door guards on there. So if I swing my door open, I won't chip my paint or, or chip anybody else's paint. And of course, they tinted the windows. Um, they didn't put a front strip on here, which is fine. I didn't really want the front window tinted anyway, but so, I mean, they did an awesome job on the tent, man, as well. I have a dark interior, so it's gonna look dark anyway. And then with the color, it's gonna absolutely be amazing. So I just wanna let YouTube know, man, and everybody in the Dodge world know, hey, Reggie, I appreciate you for calling me, checking on me today, man. That's one of my partners that I met off YouTube that lives in Georgia, and that's my partner, and we ride on a regular basis on on some real stuff. So, Reg, I want to say I appreciate you. Thank you for calling, checking on your boy, man. And everybody else, man, that, that showed concern, um, I didn't get a chance to answer any questions today because I was still kind of in my feelings a little bit. Um, but, like I say, man, I want to definitely thank Hendrick Dodge, man, I definitely appreciate that. They took care of me. Um, they let me know that as a customer, I'm appreciated. As a customer, I'm valued. And a lot of the misunderstanding was my fault because I was screaming, cursing, yelling, doing all this. I mean, just being irate, man. You know what I'm saying? So, and some people are like, well, man, why do you just, because you're not going to do that all the time. So just, I don't want to hear that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That was my mistake. I apologize for it. And uh, like I say once again, man, thank you, uh, Chrysler, Dodge. I appreciate that. Um, you let me know that you value me as a, as, a, as a customer, as a consumer of your product, as a brand lover. And I just want to say I, I greatly appreciate that. And I thank them so much, man. I mean, they did... They did an awesome job today, and, and, and it just, it's absolutely amazing. And like I said, man, I'm just, I'm super happy, super super excited. But one thing I learned, people, anybody here, that's nothing wrong with buying a used car. But this wear and tear stuff, brakes, rotors, and tires, make sure you put that in your contract. 
if you're willing to pay for it on the back end or before you buy that car, they change that stuff out. That was that was my mistake off the muscle. That was the one mistake I made with this car. Everything else on this car is covered under warranty. I had the screen replaced because the screen wouldn't update. Um, I don't. I mean, it wouldn't update. I went to um, I went to another Dodge dealership and told them it wouldn't update. They just ordered another one, and they said, "Well, it'll come with the update on us." So, I mean, that's awesome. So, like I said, I mean, I definitely appreciate that, and uh, I definitely got some mods coming now. Since I ain't got to spend that three grand, <laughs> you know, I, hey, for real, Dodge, I appreciate that. Hendrick, Dodge, and Duluth, I appreciate that, man, and and, uh, and I'm definitely a customer. Between them and Paulden, I'm a, hey, 1,000% I'm a customer, man. So, like I say, they called me today, let me know everything was going on, Um, and they actually, I actually made it late. I made it late. They could have said, well, well, we'll catch you tomorrow. They actually waited, man. I sat and talked to the service manager for about 20, 30 minutes. We chopped it up. Um, uh, the young lady that helped me at the, at the, uh, um, in the service, in the actual service drive through um, I sat and talked to them. And like a grown man, like a grown man, I apologize. Because if I had acted better, <laughs> he probably would have told me he was going to do everything he could a lot sooner. But that was, like I said, but that was me. I'm going to take the fault for that. And uh, I'm just I'm just grateful that that he didn't fly off the handle too, man. And and uh, we were able to be grown men and get it resolved. And like I said, I, I appreciate that man as a person. And I appreciate him as a Dodge employee, as a, as, a, as a Hendrick Dodge employee, man, for real. Like, they went the extra mile, man. And... They actually covered it, so I'm actually super excited. I'm super happy about that. That thing look good, man. That thing look good. Man, oh, my bad. I'm being selfish, y'all. I ain't give you no... I ain't start that guy up for you. Yo, Reggie, man, hey, you got to get your tent, bro. You got to get your tent, bro. You see me, man, with the tent on that guy. So, like I said, man, hey, I appreciate that. Thank you. And, 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 and first of all, thank you, my subscribers. If you subscribe to my channel or if you just so happen to browse through my channel and watch some of my material, thank you. I appreciate you. Hands down. Huh? Whether you know it or not, you my partner. We partners. Huh? And if you ever in the city of Atlanta or I'm ever saying I'm going to be in your city, man, how let you around. We're going to ride. We're going to tear the streets up. And to everybody that's trying to get these cars, man, stay focused, man. Stay on your grind. Do what you got to do. Forget a hater. If you got to get a used one, just make sure you get them to replace your brakes, tires, and rotors before you drive off the lot with that car. Because if once you buy an extended warranty, everything else from that bumper to that bumper is covered. If my suspension went out, we wouldn't even have to have a conversation. <laughs> that wouldn't even have had to be a conversation. So I just want to thank everybody for for uh, for reaching out to me, man, showing concern. I appreciate that, man. We gonna keep rocking. Big shout out to these people right here, man. Huh? Hey, I appreciate that. Big shout out to Chrysler too, man. Like they call corporate Chrysler. Like on some on some real stuff. And they paid for it. So bottom of my heart, I want to thank Chrysler, man. I appreciate that for 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 valuing me as a customer. Appreciate that, man. Uh you already know, man. Go go sell more sell. Everybody have a blessed day and a blessed week, man. And one thing I learned. Don't let your emotions dictate your actions. And we can and we all need to learn that as men and as women, all right? Don't let your emotions dictate your actions. Before you blow stuff out of proportion, think about a better way to handle stuff. You know what I'm saying? We out, man. That thing look good with that tent too, man. I'm finna I'm finna get something to eat, man. Hey, everybody stay blessed. Peace up, eight time down, man. Your boy Gargoyle, sell more self.